Hey everyone, what is up? Welcome back to Nightingale Survival. Got some great, great feedback from you all. Comment section and the live stream, we were talking about it. A lot of people are enjoying this. So one thing I have to do like right away is I was told that if I go back here and finish building, remember there was a bed there, there was a cooker, another bed. I don't remember what else, but if I do that, I think allegedly I might be able to get um, a follower. And then after that, we're coming back and we're I'm going to I'm going to do the portal thingy cuz I made the cards, right? The let's see, realm cards. We needed the antiquarian card and we needed a forest card. Here's a forest card here. Funny thing is this realm that I'm in here is a forest card as well. So <clears throat> next realm will maybe look something like this. Not quite because actually cha the realm changed when I, I forget what I did. I did something over here and it changed the realm to this like all pink stuff. So, all right, let's get a move on. I'm gonna run over here. We got pigs again here. You can get by these fools. Not really, I'm just looking to get over here and get this done. <clears throat> so hopefully I can do that without <laughs> causing too much of a stir. I'm looking forward to seeing like what the next realm does for us. And I mean, I've got questions internally, like, okay, number one, like this, right? So this, I should, this should return me back to my house here. Once I go through a realm, I wonder if this would return me back to this place until I build a new one. You know what I mean? Like build a new uh, little respite statue thingy. So that's one thing that's on my mind. Another thing is how far does this go being that it is a early access, right? Like how, how far can I go? I don't know, we're gonna find out. Obviously, there's some other things, like the puzzle pieces. I don't know what's going on with that, but we'll figure that out. Or it'll figure it out for us. Um, why does this not feel right? I never visited that ship. Okay, I feel like... Okay, I've obviously never been here before. I feel like I've missed the boat again. No? Okay, so we just haven't gone far enough yet. Interesting. There's that ship. Oh, I remember that thing. Okay, now I remember that thing. Okay, that's where we need to go. We got this thing here. I think I need to go farther down that way, if I remember correctly. at the edge here. Piggies. <clears throat> so I found, I figured out if you have a spot, you know, in your six through zero. Okay. Wow, he really knocked me back, didn't he? I guess he, uh, you know. Oh, yeah, they're, uh, they just want to die. They just want to become breakfast. So I figured if you have a blank space there and you don't feel like carrying your umbrella around or whatever, you just hit the blank space, obviously, and it'll, it'll take out whatever's in your hand. But now, because I don't have a blank space, it's going to be there. That's okay. <laughs> when I spawned in, when I came into the server... I had the umbrella. It was showing me. I think I looked at, yeah, this image here. I'm like, oh my god, I look ridiculous in this getup. Plus, I was holding an umbrella over my head. It was, it wasn't really the best, the best sight for me. <laughs> like, dude, I look ridiculous. All right, let's see what happens here. So, Gladys, 
uh, we got the Essence Trader, and we got Sa uh, Wilhelmina Sasse. So I built that thing. I built that thing. Built that thing. Built that thing. Oh. Now that thing just opened. Magic chest. Dude, I... Okay, I didn't even... I don't know. I guess when I first came here, I didn't even pay attention to this thing. Gives us some essence dust. Okay. Maybe... Maybe that's what they meant, that... Speak with Gladys. For hire. Recruit Gladys. Here we go. Alright. Manage equipment and inventory. So Gladys has got level 16 regular clothes, so she can keep all that. She's got that, which I guess that's what she can battle with for now. I could make her a knife. If she wants it. Maybe Gladys is like a power mover. All right, we did it, you guys. So that was it. That was it. Thank you guys for letting me know. It's funny because I came here, I did this and this. It would have been so easy, easy to do that. I just figured this was like, hey, you traveled pretty far from your house, right? And here's, and it was dark. Thinking, oh, they thought ahead. I could just make something here and here, but allegedly it was for that so now is she just gonna follow us we'll see how the ai works i'm not honestly i'm not super concerned about it you know i, I have an <laughs> i have enough problems worrying about myself that i don't really want to have to worry about gladys my luck she'll get like i'll go up here and go this way and she's gonna try and follow me that way and she'll get stuck somewhere We'll see. A good way to do it would be like have her, have your follower uh, have teleport capabilities where they just would teleport up to you. I don't think, I don't think that really, um, I don't think that really like, for me that doesn't really break like the, the lore, you know? It's not like they're gonna teleport all of a sudden to save you. I'm saying just to keep up with you as you're running around. Just allow them to teleport. Now, I know I'm actually going off a whole different way here, but I haven't I haven't been this way. Look, mushrooms. That last, that last one, I was looking around everywhere for berries and mushrooms, and now I just found three mushrooms, four mushrooms. Now, that might be because it's around this statue. Oh, and there goes Gladys just chopping a tree onto my head. Now, does she pick... Okay, she's not going to pick it up. I guess I can pick it up for now. I do appreciate this, because this can get monotonous a little bit. Like, if you need a... If you're going to build something... A lot of things require the wood like that. So... And she started... So, as, as you stand still, she's just going to start chopping things. But... It, does that mean she's going to, like clear my area my house area because I, I like the look of trees around my house you know right now i'm thinking ahead a little bit i'm thinking the ink dyes that i needed even though those things actually created a lot of ink i heard a pig oh right there all right here's the thingy oh there's a okay so is that her health there's a there's this, and then there's one of those up there at that tower. It's a gate. It's a gate. And that gate... I'll tell you that this place is... It's really not the easiest thing to get to. Oh, shoot. Okay. Well, we're going to test Gladys's uh, ability to... Come down a cliff on us. Alright. 
go back to food. Look, beds here, a cooker. Those beds are already built. Huh. I wonder what... Pick up poison marble tin. Is that gonna hurt me? Poison marble tin. Interesting, that's... Oh, I, buckshot? What did that say? Poison marble. Oh, it's marbles made from tin. I think these are for that, that bow launcher thing. We got those, we got fire marbles, lightning buckshot cartridge. That's what I saw. And ice revolt. Wow, there is a, a variety of bullets in this game. Cool. Did not know that. Now, the last one of these. All right, new codex added. Farther reaches. This is like, these things just seem to tell a story, not really telling me that I need to do something. Marcus dismounted, view the world ahead. Right, so. I shall show you through the gate with flourish. The night commander parted with glimmering magic and entered the darkness so close to his heels. So the other ones look like this, and it told me what I needed to do to get through. I guess I'll test them. Okay, so yeah, I can't go through these. So the quest the question would be is would be this one and that other one I saw over there. What do we need to do? Maybe it's um the other one was this level here. Now why am I at 19 now with my gear? It could it be that they're starting to erode and I lost a step. This gear number was what got me into the other one. All right. This is the only stuff we can build here. So we've got to go to the next realm, and hopefully that's going to answer some questions. Should I go around the other side? This is going to answer some questions like, are we going to travel from there to here? Wow, look at all that gold on that thing. Are we going to be traveling back and forth? Are we going to be building a new home? You know, that's the questions needing answered now. I think that's where I live over there. Yeah, I found... Remember I was trying to go around the water the other way for some reason? Oh, because there's the port. So my house is there. I walk down that way when I should just come around here. What's that noise? You see, there's a different lake here. Yeah, the only... There's wolves. The only thing to do is to move forward. We've got to move forward. And see what the game is going to tell us to do next. If there's a whole series of things to do over there, it's probably going to be good. Gladys, we're gonna we're gonna test your uh, your battle capabilities because there's some wolves right here. Sleeping wolf. I'm using the axe just to see how good. Now you switch the knife and you can do your thing. If she fells a tree on my head, we're going to have issues. <laughs> we're going to have some major issues. You know what the, the axe felt like? Yes, it was slower, right? Yes, it took more stamina. But it, it, it seemed like that it stopped them. It seemed like it stopped them from hitting me. Like when they were charging, when I hit them, it kind of stopped them in their tracks. So, maybe. I took a hit on that one. I think, I think Gladys just took a hit. All right, I did take a hit on that one. Might have been just bad timing, 
but what I was getting at was that could be good. You could stand your ground a little bit, and I don't know. I got a, used to using the the blade and moving around. Gladys. She is a tree chopping fool. Well, hopefully, we need something that needs a lot of wood. So, I gotta get over there. I'm just lower down from where I normally run, which is right up there. Alright. Good. That was actually. It's, it's weird. You can look across something and go, oh, there's that ship. I have no idea why I kept trying to go that way. Sounds like a storm. Yep, storm. There's a storm a brewing. Oh, look at this thing. I didn't. There's weird. Oh, look, berries and berries and ber berries, mushrooms, all that stuff I needed. Look at all the stuff right here. Look, mushrooms, berries. Look at how many berries are right here. And mushrooms. Remember all that walking around? I, Gladys, you just actually fell that tree on my head. Anyway, right there, and here's my house right here. Unreal. I don't know if that's because I left the server and came back another day. What is that noise? What? Why? Okay, this isn't good. Have not seen this before. I thought he was taking my house down. Look, he just knocks trees down. We're going to have plenty of wood to put in our storage. I would imagine that you can come back to a realm. If you can't come back to a realm, like, you've got to take your inventory with you. At least what you think. Yeah, look, there's mushrooms, mushrooms. It looks like... It looks like servers maybe respawn, because there's a ton of mushrooms around here. A ton. Yeah, it had to be that. Yeah, see, he just walks through and knocks down random trees. Yeah, a lot of trees have grown back, so... And they've apparently grown back inside my house. Cool. All right, so let's get this wood out of here. Yeah, who is right? All right? Um, I got some pelts in here. Put this in there. Feathers, bones. Might have to make another chest pretty soon. Put this away. Take the meat out of here. I think I'll make another chest. Let's see, crude plant fiber. Let's make another storage thingy. She's just out there cutting. So, food, food, berries, berries, mushrooms. All right. And then these ammo things. I'm going to put the ammo things in here. Food and ammo, right? I think I had one thing of ammo over here, which is this guy and the gunpowder. Gunpowder. Okay. It's gonna really, it's gonna really hurt my feelings about traversal, traversal, traversal. Going in the portal, right? Just stay, Gladys. Just stay inside. About going in the portal. Let's see what time of day it is. It is 3:58 p.m. There's, there's Gladys, and then here's the portal. Now, what? Look at this stuff come back. That's a little wacky.
So he's been gone for a long time, like somewhere else in the world. Now he's back. And he's... Oh, my guy's like really complaining about the weather. Might as well pick up some wood. Yeah, he left, came back. All right. We got wood for stinking days now. Wow, these, why do these things keep coming? Oh, is it? You know what it must be? When he growls or yells or whatever he's doing is regrowing everything. That can be the only thing, right? It's got to be what it is. All right, so. In the back of my mind, I'm thinking I should take some stuff with me. Because in the... Okay, let's say right now. This is the first realm that we came into that wasn't what they were calling some kind of transitional realms, right? None of those other... This realm doesn't have a portal for me to go backward. So... Man. You're probably like, why don't you just take some stuff? But it's like, what do I take, right? I've got some hides, leather. You know what? Let's see what we have here. 65, we have these bones, we have leather. We have potions. We have more stuff, great healing potions. Maybe I'll take that with me. Wicks. All the food. How much food do I have on me? Nine and five still. All right, let's just... Yeah, he keeps growing stuff in here. Let's get a short rest on. And let's go. Because this guy is... For some reason, he's locked in my area now. And... Which would have been cool earlier when I really wanted all that wood. All right, let's see. I'm just gonna take a chance. I mean, if, if I can't come back, I can't come back, right? You can't cry over spilt milk. All right, so it wants the antiquarian card and it wants the forest card. Okay, there's the portal, and it says traverse it, so... Is it ready? It's not ready. Oh, that just hurt. Oh, shoot! Okay. Yeah, that's pretty good, right? So maybe the hammer, the axe, something might be pretty good. Is it ready yet? No. More bad guys gonna come out? Yeah, looks like it's got some redness to it. If you can get that headshot on him, it's pretty good. Nice. Nice shot. The, you know what? No matter how much she hits or doesn't hit, that's definitely helpful. It's definitely helpful, right? All right. Take shelter when hailstorms strike. They can be lethal. Well, that's good to know. You don't want to get bonked on the head by a baseball-sized piece of hail. <laughs> we had hail hit here a few years. I mean, hail hits here all the time. Actually hits in the winter and it'll hit in monsoon season in the summer but two two or three years ago 
We had a hailstorm come through. It was like a 20 minute one and it hit where all the car dealerships are. And they, they told, I found out later they wrote off almost their whole inventory because it all got dented up. Like, I don't know what, don't you think you could sell a new car for like way cheaper and not, and not just write them off? Okay. Oh, look, it brought us right to here. Now, is this a return one? Okay, right now this portal's active, which makes me think I could return. All right, talk to Aurelio Acevedo. Avocado. Hey, Gladys, can you please not chop down Aurelio's trees? That archway sparkling to life roused the dread in this weary head. Glad it was only you who stepped out. Hold on a minute. I recognize that dangling chain from miles away. A Realm Walker's pocket watch. Hermetic guidebook, too. But you're no member of the Explorer's League. Um, I was given these tools. I suppose you'd say the same thing even if you weren't. Yeah, probably. Admittedly, I won't know... Quartermain's newest geo arcane recruits. Dark eyes, infinite in the infant in these realms, refuge fleeing the pale, I hazard. Hmm, yes. Suppose we're all realm walkers now. Probably. Aurelio Acevedo Ortega is the name. Ambassador Explorer is my game. Realm Walker by trade, resting my trotters. Wherever you headed, um, I may require aid. I imagine so. I find myself realms by choice. It seems the recent influx of visitors do not wish the explorer's life. The explorers, if you've been doing for 30 years, forgive my ignorance. Is there a way back to earth? I'm making course for Nightingale. You're fortunate the city still breathes at all however the portal network dismantled your path to city magic is a labyrinth of connections with no map i cannot get you there but i have a colleague shall we say whose mich mission matches your own nelly bly i know little about her concrete plans but she was working with the quarter main attempting to find hey man you know where I can reach her, then. I know where she is. Unprepared survivor on a perilous jaunt to find her. She's a grind. She'd grind my brain into sausage. All right. I like sausage. And uh, so call me bygone Asterius. Easy to learn. Okay. This guy talks a lot. To prove you're up to the task, what do you say? A series of three trials. Very same, I, okay, I suppose I could give it a try. Uh, doesn't feel like I got much. Quest or quest, okay. You better find more confidence in your stride. All right, how about some better gear, friend? First trial is about assessing your surroundings. There are all major fey ruins in this realm, and there are ruins, there are secrets. They hide valuable essences in their architecture and something to do with clauses and contracts. Realm walkers were often hired extractors of materials. Oh, so you want me to go mining. Okay, so explore these sites. Return when you hold essences in hand. Ruin essences is enough to get my head spinning. I admit I'm treading near my neck. Whatever it takes to be a realm walker. For raw experience comes knowledge. When your trial is complete, complete I shall be here. Right then, to the essences. Off you go. Show me what you're made of. Wear those boots well. And to hell with cowardice. Couldn't have said it better myself. All right. Acquired T1 Essence. 20 of 25. I already have some. Um, T1 Essence. Hmm. I, I don't know where I... I don't know where I got it from. Maybe some of those things I killed? Like the bandit dudes? Bandit. Whatever. Band... Banded. Not bandit. Okay, how's this world look? Okay, this is this could be a problem. Like we have to like loop around. 
This is a bigger area than where we were just at. So, there's an essence trader. Another essence trader. There's a Fey Tower, which I believe that's what I went through before. What's that? That looks like a wolf that wants to kill me. Okay. So, he's telling us we need to venture around. He's telling us that we need to venture around. So, this way I'm looking at that over there somewhere. There's a little house right there. Good job, Lattice. Let's go check out this house over here. I, I'm just guessing... I think those are supposed to be rabbits. I'm guessing that that portal is still active for me to go back to my house. That's what I'm thinking. House, little shed here. There's a little shed right there. There's a wolfie here. There's something big right up there. I guess we gotta go look... Okay, these are stronger. These are stronger wolves. They're taking more hits. Headshot. Headshot. Okay, we're gonna pick up everything. Maybe I can just, instead of crafting something here for now, I don't know, I'm gonna need benches, I would imagine. But for now, maybe I'll just make some uh, storage things inside here. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see what this place is all about. A fortress of knowledge, a fugitive in the realms. That's me, I'm a fugitive. Transept. Seen footnotes. He settled, begging me to work. For okay, so is this someone in here? Interior junk. Hmm. This isn't. This isn't that impressive of a house. If she keeps chopping stuff down, we. I can just make something out of wood. I, it doesn't need to be. One of the stone ones, like I did. Can just make something out of wood. All right, let's go check this one over here then. What was that? An ingot. Okay, so. She's doing. I wonder if I can repair this. Let's see. X. Copy, move, or remove. Maybe I need one of those hammers to do repairs. Alright, how about. I'll try and get some of this stuff. Need it. I need this stuff to make chests. Storage chest. Stam the stamina takes a lot with it. I wonder if it's because it's a one-handed thing that looks like it should be two-handed, right? So it's using a lot more stamina. I'm just doing a tap click on it, too. I'm not, like, wailing on it. Gladys is going to continually chop things. All right. So go in here. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe. Let's see. If I do this. The structures found in realms cannot be moved or deconstructed. Okay. Well, that makes sense. Might be better just to build my own. Something over there. Maybe we'll just build our own. Let's 
I just need a place to, um... I just need a place to... Store my... My stuff, right? Okay, building... I don't know if I want to do an estate right now. And I'm going to do this one out of wood. So the last one I did was stone. So crude foundation, plant fiber, sticks, and wood bundles. I'm guessing crude is just going to be the wood. So we'll do this guy. I don't think it needs to be this big. You really need to get out of there. You really need to... Come on, Gladys. This is going to be a problem, I think. Really? So all the wood she was chopping... Yeah, I probably made this thing too big. She's already chopped some wood over here. But when she chops it, it doesn't seem like there's a ton of it. Maybe there is. Go ahead, keep chopping. I need the wood now. Right? I need more of this, more sticks too and fiber. So as I'm doing this, she could do wood. I, ge I guess maybe you could give her a different tool. And it, like say you wanted stone, you'd give her a pick. Or you wanted this, you'd give her a sickle. Maybe that's how that works. Okay, she might have some wood actually on her because I just saw her pick that wood up. She might have wood on her. Okay, she just dropped a tree on my head again. Where is she? Hey. Hey. Manage inventory. Six wood. That's it. Six wood. But I think every time she was chopping a tree, I would take off running and she would follow me, so. Way down by your inventory. I'm just doing this to, I don't know, maybe I might need a... I might need a place, you know, to do my thing. All right, so let's see. Crude solid walls. Let's do those. That. I think I'll make my doorway there. Okay. Oh, not too bad. Sticks. Plant fiber. Need more wood, Gladys. Maybe we'll help chop. Maybe we'll help chop then. Gladys, this is the time I need you chopping wood. When you see me chop, you chop. <laughs> Chopping wood for days. Probably should have just made a, a like a two platform thing, but whatever. Whatever. Live and learn. I do like it that you don't have to chop it once it hits the ground. Like in Valheim, you would knock it down, right? And then you'd have to ch finish chopping it on the ground. I need to like move, move my way around the tree or not because it's it almost feels like it stops chopping she just dropped a tree on my head again that is pick that up all 
right, we'll see where we're at with that. Boom. Okay, looking good. This one needs a doorway. Crude, no, not out of stone. Slatted? I guess that's what we need. Okay, oh, now I know why they mean slatted. You can see right through the dang thing. Okay, and then what I did before is I used the flat, I used the flat floor, that one. Because they have crude upper floor, right? That's three, three, and two. And this one's two, three, and 12. Hmm. 12 plant fiber, three bundles of wood. Whatever, we'll use the flat roof. need here I need some plant fiber and I need some wood oops all right Gladys how about you chop trees and I'll get some plant fiber I swear sometimes it's better just to run around hitting E rocks we do need a bed I will need a bed in there too not gonna worry about um, benches right now I can't <coughs> excuse me <coughs> other than that once we see the essence trader we might actually be able to unlock more stuff and at that point I'll probably need a bench so here's that water Oh, that's nice looking. We're right at that water's edge. Not as big as you thought. Gladys, are you chopping trees, I hope? See, as I started walking away, she did too. Interesting. Flotation device. Right on my head. Bong did along. Alright, that that should be enough. I don't know if she's picked anything up. Should be enough. It's amazing how far you can get away from your house so quickly. Do, 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 do. Okay, done. It's a little little airy in here. <laughs> All right, let's bake a bed. We'll need um. We'll need resting bed. Okay, and then maybe one of those campfires. One of them, their campfire thing is basics. So we have tanning station, campfire. That's what we want. Perfect. And now we need, if I have the stuff, storage. I gotta start with three. Oh, I almost made it. All right, so first one. Tin, hide, meat, wood, wood, rocks, and bones. All right, perfect. Now, I need to, how much essence? I have 130 essence, so let's repair this. Let's repair that. Let's repair that. And we'll repair that. Still says I have 130 essence. Tell me that that didn't just use this essence. So that's weird. 
It says it takes essence to repair stuff, right? So 15 essence dust. Is it just lagging behind? Why isn't it using my essence? I'm not complaining, but if that's the case... I just don't want to use that uh, that good essence because that's the stuff I'm looking for right now. Hmm. Didn't use it. What time is it? It is 2.53 p.m. All right. How about we eat? And we short rest it. Now we got to go look for something. So... We're here. We should probably search. There's that wolf moving around. I could go around and check out this dude, or we could go searching. Let's let's go let's go see if we can talk to the essence dude. Maybe he's got like some really Gladys. Maybe he's got something good that we can unlock, right? And craft. I'm gonna try and go. Piggy. Who? All right, Piggy. You're going to get the axe. Get him, Gladys. Looks like Gladys took a swing at the other Piggy already. He had half health. Oh, that was a headshot right there. Oh, right there. 23. So yeah, all right. Maybe we could get this stuff from just killing animals. Okay. Is it going to start raining? We're going to have to put our umbrella on. So look, there's a partially built building there. I wonder if I can build that and get another follower, right? Maybe there's someone... Maybe that's like the pattern. The essence traders will have a person there, and if we build that, we can get them to come hang out with us. All right, there's a big moose over there. So there's moose in this world as well. Running. I'm gonna just try and collect stuff as I run. Like I said, I know the the sickle, but man, it's the sickle slow. It's exhausting, and it's like, dude, if you're running somewhere, just collect. What I really need is to build up my fiber and sticks in case I need to build something over here. Like I'm clearing a path. I actually have my umbrella out for a reason. Look, there's a... Whoa, there's a castle-looking thing there. All right, there's going to be some cool stuff in here. Now, see, this makes more sense. It's like, hey, why don't you finish building our thingy here and kill these pigs? I didn't just hit Alberta. Oh, I need that. Was it Alberta that he said that we want to travel with? Okay, so what do we need? We got sticks, wood bundles, stone blocks for days. Wowzers. Okay. Makes sense. It's a pretty cool looking place, though. I like it a lot. And then we'll get this thing to open, right? Might as well take advantage of this. Go ahead and chop. Feel free to chop all you want now, Gladys. This is when you this is when you hold your own, my friend. Well, 
That is a big tree. You chop, I'll pick it up. have her carry the wood all right so this thing basically we need 50 yeah 58 stone I think to finish the whole thing I've already built the roof with the logs and the other stuff all right let's talk to Anton see what he's got going on all right, so furniture, we're not worried about furniture right now. Refinement and crafting, a simple table saw, we've got that. Basics and repair, we've got that. Resource, you can buy stuff from him. A simple wooden table. No, thank you. All right, so this rain, we need to find. We need to find a bunch of stone. Now, a lot of times around the edges here, like that might be, let's see, this is, this is, that is, that is, that is, all right. This may be, yep, yeah. all right, let's do this. We're gonna get rained on, but whatever. <laughs> Each one of these I think is worth three. Good thing is it's usually only one hit for this stuff. Now, uh, I could try and give Gladys a pick, but honestly, these things, they're not like trees, you know? They're kind of spread out. So it'd be more like me standing there watching her try to do this instead of just, you know the old saying, if you want something done right, give Gladys a pick. Oh, do I see my last essence over there that I need? Wow, you guys see I never look at the screen, it's true. Wow, look at that crazy deer. Look at this. 25 of 25, now we gotta go talk to Avocado. But before we do that, to see, since, that totally reminds me of, look, when I said before, this has got a Skyrim feel, a lot of people said it had a Valheim feel, except in first person. I, I did mention it early on. Um, Horizon Zero Dawn. Obviously not to that extent, but like weird colorful animals that could, you know, be like Horizon Zero Dawn animals, right? Maybe a little bit? Come on, you guys see it. You see it. Now, the, the more you get weighted down, the slower you get, obviously, but... See, like that thing. You don't think that could be from her? It, maybe if it was mechanical, then you'd be like, yeah, maybe Horizon Zero Dawn, we get it. Eight of 32. Okay, we got it partially built. Oh yeah, it's looking pretty good. Did that take all my stuff? Yes, it did. All right, let's get some more stone. here we should have a good amount of stone see if it wasn't for you guys telling me that like this one is like a little bit more obvious right this this is more obvious than the beds the beds i thought were just for me walking up here you're like wait a minute there's there's a, th a house to be built here right i don't know maybe i would have figured it out maybe not but thanks to you all we got gladys and her infinite chopping abilities. Infinite chopping abilities. Do, do, do. Hmm. 
Okay, we got a decent amount here. not get too weighed down because we're kind of getting farther away from this place. Early on, episode two or something, I was collecting wood. <laughs> it's like I really encumbered because I wanted all this wood. And you can't jump when you're like this. And I was pretty far away from my house. I actually had to drop the wood, go back, put stone. I don't know. Maybe it was stone, something like that. done that part's done now I got to do the table which it needs lumber did that okay so the table needs lumber which means they're gonna want me to make a a saw table I think maybe this is this is kind of cool uh, insight into you're like, well, why would I why would I buy that? I don't need that. But right now it's like I need a simple saw table, right? To make lumber. And if I didn't have the, the ability animal fiber. Which means I need to make a tanning bench to make the animal fiber. What did she do with the wood? What did she do with the wood? Um, she dropped the wood or ate it or something. What? That doesn't make sense. Why? I thought I could use her as like a a mule for wood, but not only the one that she had, but whatever the six that I gave her, they're all gone. All right, fine. Getting the feeling that maybe Gladys is only going to be good for helping me fight, which is fine, too. If I don't, like, I don't know. We'll see. So far, it's it's a little patchy with the wood thing. That would have been cool to be able to give her wood, right? And just take it. But it didn't work. This... Is this her wood? No, that seems... Maybe. Maybe she dropped it there. I don't know. Alright, now we need animal fiber. So in order for animal fiber, I believe we have to make a tanning thingy. Which I don't see one here. Yeah, they're tall. Let's see. Chop all, do I want to chop their stuff up, though? I don't think so. So, she's got an axe, too. All right, we'll make a, a tanning thingy in here, I guess. This is all just to finish this, so... That's this stuff, and then... Let's see. Enchanter's focus, sewing, tanning. Yeah, I know it's crooked, but that's all I had. Plant fiber. I hear something. I hear something in the distance. Might be with that big moose dude walk through here because look. I think you can I befriend the moose? Cause he's a good wood chopper. Oh, now I'm weighed down. I need these bushes here. You're like, use your sickle. You'll get more. I should have some meat on me, which is good, cause then I can make, I can make the fiber from the meat. 
You know, I, I'm thinking when they say animal fiber, may, maybe they're maybe they're talking about sinew. You know, sinew, something like that. <coughs> maybe, maybe not. Okay. All right, so we need four animal fiber. Autofill. And I need four. That's what I have. Come on, baby. I need to put a bed here, man. I'm getting tired. Need one more stone block. Okay. How about we get some storage going here. Of course, I need one more. Yeah, I can hear that moose walking around somewhere. Alberta's got a pickaxe. She's got a pickaxe. 22 wood. Sticks, rocks, bones. All right, I need, need to go get some more. Uh... Might as well pick this up because they're not going to. I just need to go get a little bit more stone. And we should be done. We can build some lumber for them. While we're here, might as well get a little bit. Huh. Nice. Oh. Okay, so she does kind of teleport. We just witnessed it. There is a bit of teleportation going on. Alright, that should be good. I just heard something roar over there. There's some odd sounds going on that is a bit scary. All right, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna finish doing this. I'm gonna finish this house. We're gonna come back next episode and continue on from there. You will not miss anything, except maybe, why is that not look fit? Wait a second. What happened here? Um, dude, everything got destroyed. Everything got destroyed. What? What happened here? What? What? Is she picking stuff up and putting it back right now? What the heck happened? Um, that's borked, dude. I just got all that stuff to do this. Huh. So my tanning bench is gone. This has got a ton of resources needed again. That's whack, dude. Two lumber. Hmm. I think I'm gonna have to collect a bunch of stuff again. Why did it break? Did the moose come through and break it? Back to 40 stone blocks needed. 
I'm gonna try and finish this before this is part of it. Wow, a lot of plant fiber missing. And it's not like it broke and it's all on the ground. Some stuff was on the ground. Why did it break? That literally makes no sense to me. And why did it start putting itself back together? Uh, the only thing I can think of is that she picked up some stuff and she was adding to it. and then a bunch of that. All right, we're going to come back next episode, you guys. I'm going to go gather some more stone real quick. Thanks for watching.